the world's first 3D printed neighborhood now has its first homes in a rural town in southern Mexico. Joining me now with more on this is Brett Hagler, CEO and co-founder of New Story, the nonprofit that helped build these homes. Good morning to you, Brett. This is an incredible undertaking. How do you make a home with a 3D printer? <laughs> yeah, it's great, great to be on. Good morning. Um, so we, uh, New Story, partnered with um, an organization called Icon, and we created a 3D printing home machine that can print a home using a proprietary cement mix. And how I explain it to my mom is um, it's almost like soft syrup ice cream um, coming out, and it layers a built-to-last house. Built to last, and how long does it take to create one home? Uh, about 24 printing hours. That is and just these, amazing. And these are, yeah, and these are the um, the first two uh, printed homes that uh, families will live in, uh, families in extreme poverty in rural Mexico. And the really encouraging thing about that is it's only going to get faster um, from here because it's just the very beginning. And there's something unique about these homes apart from the fact that they're built with a 3D printer, people that live in these homes are in a seismic zone that is prone to flooding. How will these homes protect these residents? Yeah, so we, um, you know, it would have been a lot easier to do the first 3D printed neighborhood uh, in, an, in an area that wasn't seismic and didn't, was not prone to flooding. Um, but because our mission is to end global homelessness, um, we want to work in, an, in environments that are very challenging. And so this was a, a, a proof point that you can bring breakthrough innovation to the areas that need it most. Um, and that's how we designed the machine um, so that it could work in these environments. How much does it cost to create one of these homes? We uh, unfortunately can't share the exact cost yet because it's still so early. Um, but the homes are, are lower priced than a traditionally built house. And your goal, as I understand it, is to build 50 new homes by the end of 2020. What happens after that? Yeah, so that'll conclude the, the world's first 3D printed neighborhood. Um, we hope this will be uh, a showcase to share with the world what's possible um, and to bring innovation for families that are in the most need. Um, and then from there, we will scale out um, 3D printing machines. And with our partner Icon, we will um, bring homes and communities uh, to families in need around the world. Amazing stuff. Brett, thank you so much. Glad you could be with us. All the best. All right. Thank you for having me. Thanks for watching. If you like this, be sure to subscribe here. And you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.